they're all up now. Oh, <laughs> except that one. <laughs> get up, big lazy one. How big did they get? Oh, wow. Guys, welcome back to another episode of Atlas Survival Shelters. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Now, I know most of you watching my videos did not get out to Sandy, Utah to see the Be Prepared Expo. So I'm going to bring the expo to you. So I did three days of editing to get this down to one hour, and boy, is it entertaining. So if you can, watch this video on a big screen TV. I think it will show better, and you'll feel like you were at the show, but boy, did they have some really cool stuff. But one other thing that I was there doing, I was promoting Goldbacks. Why? Because those things are just too damn cool. So I ended up giving Goldbacks away to everybody who saw me and recognized me, whether you were a guy sitting in the airport, a pretty girl on a plane, or a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. I'm at Dallas Love Field, and I see Maddie, and I always see her on YouTube. She's like the coolest Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. Everyone loves her, guys. She's like so cool. <laughs> Last year, the whole process of going through training camp and getting cut, it was super hard. So that would be your last nine. And Amy is going on this side. Oh, what? Judy made it a very nonchalant formation change. Wasn't expecting it at all. This gives us a second look in the triangle. Woo! See guys, everyone that came to see me at the show got one of the free guns. So you guys who didn't show up, see what you missed out on? They got gold packs and a gun. something different duct aid hey guys how you doing what is duct aid it's a uh, a first aid kit that's based around that duct tape can fix anything so we took a uh, the dirty adhesive from duct tape and replaced it with a skin safe clean adhesive um, inside of the roll you have this packaging and everything you see in this display fits inside this roll um, it's designed in such a way that it stabilizes any major medical situation. Um, the first thing you see when you open up the, the packaging is you have a QR code and it links you to this PDF that's going to show you how to use our kit specifically to stabilize any inju your injury. So you can make this double as a sling, shows you how to wrap a foot using the tape, um, burn injuries, anyway. It's a really versatile kit. It weighs just over a pound. I mean, it's super lightweight, easy yeah. to carry. You can flip it over. It's got a strap on the bottom of it so you can put on a bike seat. Anyway, throw it in a truck. They're awesome. They're great. And how much do they cost? Uh, the show special is $80. Uh, if you buy four or more, the price drops down to 50 a piece. So this here is just for the roll yeah, of this is, tape. Yeah, this is just tape. So if you just want the tape, it's $16. Uh, a roll for one if you're buying multiple as the whole kit uh, comes in at uh, 50 if you buy four or more wow this so. is cool I've never seen this product before it's called duct aid As a general rule of thumb, we suggest stocking two filters per person per day. Hi, so I'm at the Be Prepared show. Here's uh, the owner of Mirror Safety. 
and uh, social media manager Eric. all right social media guys so I imagine business is good for you guys isn't it certainly, uh, it's certainly. been it's been busy it's wow been absolutely yeah, busy, so. that war is uh caused a big demand so you say your stuff is made in Czechoslovakia yeah Czech Republic most of our products are European made we do manufacture some products in Israel as well we work with the uh, oh. Israeli Defense Forces there. Yeah, they make good um, stuff over there. What's that right absolutely. there? You got some uh, body armor? We have body armor as well, yes. Uh, 10 by 12, we have side plates as well, level four rated. I'm surprised you're at the show. <laughs> you know what, we decided to check it out. This is actually our first preparedness show. Really? We usually go to SHOT Show and some of the bigger shows, but we wanted to come check out Utah. It's my first time in Utah, your first time in my Utah, first time as, well. Utah as well. Yes. Uh, so we wanted to see what Utah is all about. We hear this is the preparedness capital of the U.S., more preppers per unit area here yeah. than anywhere else, so we're, we're here, we're, we're checking too. it out. Yeah. <laughs> Sir, I bet people are just dying to do hey, business boy. with you. This guy's awesome. I guess preparing to die is part of preparation. Yep. This is one of the displays at the Be Prepared show that I want to check it out because he's selling these bags where you can He's advertising you can bury guns. So what is this? Tell me. What this is, is it's uh, it's called intercept technology. It's a, it's a material that has come through by other industries. We have um, found a way to be able to take, Bell Labs found a way to be able to take copper and put it into the polymer matrix of a plastic bag. So what you need to do is you just have to put your product inside here and we give you some of our saturated foam packs to put inside the bag along with desiccants. And within about 15, 20 minutes time, all the, uh, the, the, all the corrosive gases that are inside the bag will be trapped into the bag and be absorbed into the copper. So as a result of that, we're gonna take the sealer and we're gonna seal both of the bags together with this sealer, putting this type of a seal on the bags and then it'll give you the ability to be able to store the bag for up to 25 years and keep your product in pristine shape. So you're advertising like bury your guns, bury all kinds of stuff. That's Bury guns, food stuff, um, anything that you want to be able to put in there that you want to be able to retrieve after 20, 25 years and they'll be in perfect condition. And you think they're waterproof? They're waterproof. So this bag here, what size is that? And what this, does it cost? This is a 20. Oh, there's the prices. These are the prices right here. That's a 22 by 24 bag, and that's 29.50 a kit. So that's uh, what a dollar 30 a year. Okay, so which one would be the rifle bag? The rifle bag. Yeah, there's a couple. Okay, 20 by 64. Right. So that's 4375 for the bag, and then you need to buy this that's thing here? The, that's the kit for everything that the bag encompasses. And then the, the, um, the, the, the rental charge for a sealer is $24.99. Although there are a lot of people here that have been telling us about some food storage sealers that it's the, it, it, it will work on this material. So you don't so have to, you, you you, have to you, rent the sealer. So you can't, well, I don't think people want to rent. They probably want to own one. So what does one of these cost? Uh, we will have that price up on the website as well. Okay. I don't have it right now. So this is called In Case. In Case It. Oh, cool. Well, thanks a lot. Thank you. Good luck at the show. Thank you. Any water, anywhere. Just scoop it up out of any river, stream, mud puddle, stagnant pool. And this is what it's going to look like, possibly, of what you might be. Water. Just put it in, put it in there. It's going to see all those nasty things crawling around in it. Screw the lid on tight. Pop the top, squeeze and drain. It's going to take out all the toxic chemicals. It's going to take out everything that will hurt you in North South America. And it's going to take out Jardia, Cryptosporidium, E. coli, anything. Instant clear water, and it'll do that for 150 gallons before you have to replace the filter. Then all you need to do is unscrew the filter, put a new script, uh, filter on, and do it all over again for 150 gallons. Best tested bottle in the world. Now what is this? This is the... This is the Seychelles. 
Say cell. Water, water box. filtration. Just like that in that demo, exactly what I showed you. You can get it in a canteen. Same thing. Oh wow. And we even have a pump. So this has the filter in it too. Yes. yes. And then we also have the high volume pump. Oh, this is cool. Yeah. That. Now, what do these things cost? So, our bottles, $35 for one, two for 60. Okay. If you have a, a large family, we have a four pack, it's 120. And then I'll add another bottle three. Oh, That's so five for 120. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. And what about the canteen? $40 for the bottle. And the sleeve is $7. Today, I'm adding the sleeve free. Wow. And what about $69. this? $69. And, it, and it comes with a Supreme filter that's $47 on its own, plus your standard filter. It has a two filter system, one right here and one in here. Here. Wow. Great for you. What else do you have over here? You got these solar lights? I have the solar, nine function solar lights. Uh, we got a deal going on. I normally sell them for thirty-nine dollars. I'm selling them for thirty or two for fifty. Lead Lenser, which is one of the top three in the world, I got a really special deal on them. It's a little 140 lamp, and that's up. It's twenty bucks. I have the Rapid Rope. If you watch Shark Tank, this is on Shark Tank. Eleven hundred pound test comes in a self. Uh, it's 1100 comes out it's got a cutter in the top so you can go around it and it will cut it so it's easy great for we put these in 72 hour emergency kits now instead of paracord twice the strength and you can do more with it and this was on shark tank yeah yeah were you on it no no oh chris who happened to be a friend of mine it's his company wow that's yeah. 20 bucks 20 bucks Firearm Ranch. Firearm Ranch, that's us. That's that guy? What, 240 Bravo? Or M Caucasian, over here, puppies. Look at that big dog. Hey, puppy. Oh. Oh. oh my god, is this one letter? Yes. Daddy's over there. Eight? Or, was there eight? Or did you sell some already? Um, I don't know if they have or not. Oh, they're so cute. I, god, I can't believe all this came out of a dog. Sorry. One dog. I know. Um, well, mom is like between 200 and 300 pounds. Is she? And what kind of dog is this? Caucasian, Ovarka. Puppies for sale. Twenty five hundred without papers, three thousand with papers. Oh. Morning. Keeps it burning. This is the spark we trust when failure isn't an option. Whether you're a prep, adventurer, hunter, or barbecue enthusiast, from the backyard to the backcountry, Hyrule Water is the most efficient non-toxic fire starter on the market. A patent pending blend that sticks to anything. Lights and sounds. What do you do here? I teach people how to garden. You teach people how to garden? And how to forage. Oh, wow. So I'm teaching an edible landscaping class at 11 today. Are you really? Mm -hmm. So this is just another thing they can learn yes. here at the Be Prepared Expo. And I sell um, wild edible plant card decks so they can learn what they can eat or, or use for medicinal purposes in the wild. Oh, cool. And I have a store in Bountiful where I sell edible plants, herbs, teach classes, and help people with growing and using their own Thank you. Sure, thank you. They go straight, or you can offset the cook for 
forward pit as well. The holster is designed to be modular, so you can set it up what, how it's best for you, whatever you're doing, whether you're on the range training, where you're carrying, whatever works best for you. And the other thing about the holsters that's really cool and very unique is that we have the So these Green Mountain Grills are $16.99. The bar pure delights are $14.99. Okay, do you have a Hello, young man. Are you in the army? No. Gonna be? It's early in the morning. People aren't really here yet. A yellow, white, turkey. No, yellow. Right, and see, that's the beauty. You know, it's funny because I'll tell people we have 3,000 channels and some This is something I've never seen. This is a number 10 metal canning machine for $24.99. Are these the machines right here? Yes, this is actually an old Rooney machine. It'll actually do three sizes of cans, the 300, 400, and the number 10 series. And then this is the uh, WS semi-automatic machine. That'll do a can every five seconds, a number 10 can. And uh, these are on sale, they're on special right now. It's very hard to get a canning machine that is dependable. These should last another 50 plus years. We've got spare parts for them. Uh, we've also got a uh, company that will do all of the maintenance on them as well. And, uh, and these are your cans? These are the typical number 10 cans, yes. So you're selling these to like, this is a crab company here. Uh, yeah, well this is just a, a demo can. Let me just show you how these actually operate. Yeah, so just take a second here to take one of these. It takes five seconds to uh, complete the rotation. You simply put it on there, turn it on. We're going to run it one time to make sure it's got a full rotation. And you count five seconds. Done. And you'll notice how the torque of that machine made the upper seam and seal the same as the lower seam. That means you got an airtight can that should last 30 plus years. So there's a question, how did the air get out of there or how would one get the air out, out well, of there? Well, we would put an oxygen absorber inside of this prior to the seal. Really? Do you sell CC. those as well? We do. And the cans. And what's this machine cost? That machine is $2,499. And what about this machine? $15.99. So low volume, this is good enough for somebody. If somebody's doing a commercial business, they need that one right there. That's exactly right. Or they can use this for at home and just uh, work it with their family. Where's the machine made? Made in Salt Lake City. So you're making them yourself? We're not making them, but we're selling them. You're selling them. And what does a number 10 can cost like this? About three seventy-five, dollars including the lid. Including the lid, 375. So yes. these people had their label put on there and all kinds of stuff. They did, yes. This was another company. What does that cost to have your name put on there? I do not know. <laughs> we, we have never bought them on a custom basis. Wow. But, and, your, uh, and your company is called WS Semi Automatic Canning Machine. Yes. There's his phone number, 1 817 727 6529. But this is one of the uh, rare things I've seen at a prepper show that I've never seen before and I'm sure cannon machines have been around a while but I've just never seen one at a prepper show so uh, that's amazing thank you very much thank you for stopping by ever ready industries that's ready wise food alright so here we have Home Storage Center. So what do you guys do? We represent the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints and we serve at the Bishop's Storehouse in Sandy. The, this uh, facility that sells food storage at cost 
Um, there's no sales tax involved because we are a nonprofit organization. And throughout COVID, throughout the earthquake, everything that's happened, we're the one location that never shut down through the entire process. And, Although um, we didn't have any inventory. <laughs> the pasta items are made at our plant in Kaysville. Yeah, and, and since they're made by mostly volunteers that come in and work there, we were able to sell them at the... the so what is the cost of your food? We have a free uh, flyer that's available by going to providentliving.org and clicking on food storage. And it shows you the shelf life of each product as well as the weight of the product and the price. Yeah, so for instance, that spaghetti is here, $4.75 a can. That That's spaghetti's a, 475 a can. Is it freeze dried? No. No. Oh, it's not. This isn't freeze dried. But it's no. packed with an oxygen absorber right. so that it will last for and 30 that has, years. That has 22 servings of that. How long would this last? This is a 30 year product. No kidding. So most of these things are 30 years. Um, one or two of them are uh, a little less. Our carrots are 10 years. Um, so, rough, so roughly, let's go over the prices of each one real quick. Okay. You got rolled oats, you got rice, you got beans. Exactly. Yep. Oats are five twenty-five a can. Beans run seven dollars and thirty-nine cents. Um, kind of ranges a little yeah. bit on those. So we don't have all the, you know, fancy flavors and things that a lot of food storage have, but we do have the basics that will keep you alive. And you got great prices. And we do, we do. Wow, well, we, we, five, five, six dollars a can on average. Yeah. I've never heard of you guys. Yeah. How long have y'all been doing this? We've been eight we years. personally have been there for eight years. Really? <laughs> the church has been doing it forever. <laughs> wow. Well, we know, we all know the Church of Later Day Saints is a very prepared-minded exactly. organization. And, and we, of course, we sell to anybody who wants to come in and buy because we would like to see everybody be prepared. This looks like freeze-dried candy. How are you doing today? I'm doing well, thank you, sir. Yeah, what we, is this? We've got freeze-dried candy right here in the middle. We've got freeze-dried dog treats, and then we've also got freeze-dried food storage uh, and backpacking, hiking, camping supplies that we can go ahead and get you hooked up with so that your uh, travel is a lot lighter and you can still eat well on the, on the trails. So how many types of candies do you have? So right now with us today, we have about 10 different SKUs. In general, at our store up in uh, North Ogden, we carry about 20 different SKUs. This is amazing. And what does a pack of candy like this right here, let's say, cost? This is the Starburst right here. This is going to be at $6.99, the Starburst minis. They range anywhere between $5 to $6.99 on the candies, depending on which type of candy you pick up. It's amazing. I've never seen freeze dried candies like this. How long y'all been doing this? We've been doing this since October of 2020. Really? Okay, yes, so it's a relatively, relatively new product. Relatively new and it's expanding exponentially. It's really exciting part uh, part of our part wow. of our time. We can uh, be reached at uh, www.familyfreezedry.com and we also have a brick and mortar up in Harrisville. Right, thank you. Right on. We, uh, Weber County Sports Shooting Complex. How are you doing morning. today, sir? Good morning to you guys. We, so you got uh, targets? Out to our range? No. You got we any Democrats up there? So what we got here? This is our six by eight jumping jack model. So I'll show you, I'll give you a quick rundown of how it works. To collapse it down, all we do, collapse this framework down. From that point, we just fold one side over top of the other side. Everything's hinged, we don't take any of it apart. It comes to the center, you zip it into a weather tight bag so it's completely protected. 
take the sides of the trailer, swing those up and over the top. That's what gives you the platform like you see over here to load your ATVs, motorcycles, camp gear, whatever you want right on top of it. To set it up, just unload whatever you have on top, unfold the trailer, unzip that tent bag, and pull forward on the tent. It's that fast, huh? Keeps it pretty simple. Wow. Well, you four, did all that in 50 seconds. Yep. Four different sizes, depending on how many people you need to sleep or what you need to carry on top. And when the prices start at? Start at 7,500. 7,500, and that's the big one? That's the biggest one, starts at 12.5 there. That's nice, it's really big. Well, thank you very much. Not a problem. It's big inside. Wow, really big. They have drop down storage on the side too. So you put your generator in there. Always love it. Of course, my Trump hat collection all burned up, so just have to buy me a new one. My name's Tucker. Tucker. Tucker, where you got here, buddy? Okay, so uh, we just wanted to enter the, the e-bike space and make it possible for everyone to, to have an e-bike, to enjoy them. So whether it be in the mountains, on the, on the street, or even our, our little higher-end bike, and kind of our ultimate bike, the GOAT, that's going to take you up the steep terrain and get you really anywhere you need to go. Where'd your camo bike go? So the camo bike, somebody took it. Oh man, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. That was so, my bike. So somebody snagged it. We're bringing it in. All right, well, place. luckily I got some footage of it yesterday, so here it is. But uh, damn you, damn you to hell. <laughs> well, <laughs> so, all right, so let's talk about that camera bike. Is this one basically about the same? Exact same. This, this what's, the, what's the wattage and power and everything on it? Yeah, so this is a Buffing 1000 watt mid drive motor. So it's actually producing about 160 newton meters of torque. A little more torque than a Nissan Versa, which is kind of cool. Um, it's got a 48-volt, 16-amp-hour uh, battery. And uh, with that, you're able to go in through pretty steep terrain, 20 to 25 miles I'm pretty comfortable with. On the flat, you could probably push, depending on how much throttle or pedal assist you use, 
40 plus miles. Really? Yeah. And those tires are really big, so that's for your sand and off-road? Yeah, you got four inch fat uh, Kenda tires, which are really great. They're kind of a multi-season tire. I, I've loved them up in the mountains. I've loved them in the snow. And then also, you know, if I want to take my kids out and pull them by the trailer or anything, they're great for the, the street as well. So. Well, you had a lot of bikes here yesterday. They're all gone. Yeah. So um, I guess you sold them, but uh, people came in here and went out with their bikes. So what do you got here? Yeah, so this trike is really cool. We've designed it for multiple different reasons. Um, I actually have an employee who uh, has a disabled uh, brother. And so that's kind of where it all started. And then it kind of evolved from there. We made it possible where it can actually fold in half at the hinge. It's our only foldable bike, which it's really cool to have a foldable trike. It's pretty rare. In wow, the I've never seen that. 500 watts in the front. So you get a lot of good power from the front and then it's super stable. So we love that. So the power's on the front wheel only. Correct, front wheel drive, 500 watts wow. in the front. So they can contact you at uh, rideon.us. All right, thanks a lot. Ion water treatment. How you doing? Good, how are you doing? Pretty good. What's your product do? Our product, it uh, treats water. So we have three different products. We have ion water treatment, and we have the burn treatment, and we have a book bite treatment. So the uh, water treatment, we have multiple uses. Uh, one of the main popular uses is for water storage. So it'll actually treat your water for uh, upwards uh, seven plus years. Um, it'll treat one bottle, will treat two 55 gallon drums. Um, so it's great for water storage. Some of the other uses that most people like to use it for is increase your alkalinity in your water. Um, so it has a lot of health benefits um, for alkalinity, where people want to increase the pH level of their water. So let's say you're a soldier in Ukraine and you're stuck into a, a steel mill and you can't get out and you're having to drink rainwater sitting in a ditch. Yeah, okay. it would work. So this would, this it, it, would, it, it, this would test the water or purify? Um, it will it'll purify the water. It'll it'll, purify it'll kill, the water. It'll kill the and bacteria. How many water. different types do you have here? So we have the water treatment, which is the, what you'd use for the water. We have the bug bite treatment, which you'd use for uh, if you get fighter bites, insect or mosquito bites, uh, even uh, anything that's poisonous that might bite you. So that's not even for drinking? No, well, you could use it for the drink because it's the same formula. Yeah. It's actually, it's a little more potent to actually put it on topical on your skin. So huh. basically it's gonna kill the poisons that are in the in your skin from like a spider bite. So we've had uh, customers who've got a brown recluse spider bite. Um, they've, they've started infecting their whole arm. They started putting the bug bite treatment on it. Within a few weeks, it was gone. As if there was no- What's the other one? So we have the burn treatment. It's kind of still the same base formula. And so if you have a burn, first, second, third degree burns, you apply it topically on the burn. It'll kill the infections from the burn um, and it'll oxygenate the, the burn to help heal it quicker. So you're carrying three things here. You're carrying for burns, bug bites, and for water treatment. So the What do you have here, sir? This is emergency water. 
Tell me about uh, it. No filtration and, and uh, treatment of stored water. So we have whole house systems. We have the kind that can put right in your kitchen and use on an everyday basis. We have an inexpensive disaster with a bucket system that's not beautiful, but in an emergency you can uh, you can clean any contaminated water and have it ready to drink. If there's a boiler that goes out, you can just pull it out and uh, run water through there. You don't have to boil it or treat it any, any, in any other way. So what do your systems cost on average? Well, the, the, home, the home system goes as high as $1,300. And then, you know, down to the, the kitchens. The kitchen one is $350. We've got the backpack system right right here that you can take up in the mountains. And then the bucket system is uh, only $99 today. And uh, that can be used for, for treating any water. And I've, I've tested it myself. I'm a water quality scientist. And these, uh, these new, this new filtering media that's in these takes out viruses right down to 99.9999%. And uh, they do the job. tent right there it just folds up like that Sophos Survival. I want to know more about your water tanks. Okay. We also have now, is this different from the other one over there? Um, they are, in fact, this tank is the same tank over there, but we carry a... a so it's the same dimensions? Tanks. Yeah. This is Sophos Survival. Where are you guys from? We're down in Spanish Fork on Main Street. That's Salt Lake City? Uh, no, south end of Utah County. Oh, okay. Yep. So this is for adding to old water? Uh, no, actually, so what you'll do is you'll take this and when you fill up your water tank, you will add this and then it kind of mixes it with the water as it fills up and then it will prevent any algae or slime or the, the slimy stuff, they call it biofilm, it prevents that from growing for at least five years. So it saves you a lot of time every year having to drain your water and refill it back up. The, the general rule of thumb is that you should rotate your water every 12 months. And this is called Biofilm Defender. Well, Thrive is in the house.
<laughs> You're going to get action shots. Oh, yeah, I'm telling you. Here's, here's what you start. These little batteries right here. Yeah. They're 5,000 watts each. And you can barrel them. You can get as many as you, as you want to have. And we, we sell a lot of these to recreational vehicles and people have got boats and things. The, the, these things here are one thing you could put in the lot down the shelter, but come on over here. Who makes second. that battery? A company called Vesco. Okay, I've never, helped, I've never I seen helped, one like that. I helped the company get started 11 years ago. And what's years inside ago. there? That's a prismatic cell. Okay. And that they're, they're each 3.2 volts each. Put four of them together, you get 12.8 volts, which is the exact same voltage as a car battery. This system here is a, is a brand new thing. We just got this in three days ago, <coughs> but it, it's got everything in it. Now, unfortunately, but here, we have a, a, a system here that's got the inverter, the solar charge controller, and the charger all in one system. And, and it costs like 480 bucks. Wow. And it's a 3,000 watt unit. Now that, you could use that very much in your uh, bomb shelters. Wow. So that mounts to the wall over there? Yeah, this mounts to the wall, just like that one there. So, but the nice thing is, so people who are buying these other gravity filters, they think of them in terms of emergency. They take it home, put it in the food. Sign me up. <laughs> Sign me up. Am I too old? Nope. How old do you got to be? 54 bucks. 54 and you'll take gold backs? Um, sure. Let's do it. At the show? Yeah. Okay, let's, let's do, do it. it. Let's do it. Sir, I saw that you were liking my gun over there. Are you, a, I guess you're a veteran? Yes, sir, I am. 23 years, Air Force. Would you like one of my rifles? I would love one of your rifles. Well, I brought you one. Well, thank you, sir. I love you're it. You're welcome. We appreciate your service. Thank you, and thank you for uh, supporting us veterans. Okay, five more minutes. Are you waving at me? Yes, I am. Give away. Do you recognize me? No. <laughs> no? Oh, you're waving at the camera. Oh, I thought you were one of my YouTube subscribers. Homegrown herbalist, online school of photonic medicine. The principle is you put this in your basement and wait for the rain to come. Yeah, I'm sure it's there. 
So what do you got here? What is it called? This is the homegrown herbalist bunker buster kit, and it comprises of three levels. This is one of those Dewalt modular tool tool carriers. And what's in there? So this has got three grams worth of tincture herbal medicines. They're uh, alcohol extracts to use in when the rain comes. Well, let's see what's inside there. Yeah, you've got uh, gloves. You've got sterile sponges. You've got gauze you've got sterile gloves these are um uh, sur are. surgical yeah. instruments that have been put through an autoclave so and then you got all these bottles and you've got several layers of the tincture herb bottles ranging from just about anything that you could ever need it comes with this, uh, comes with this manual that shows you how to use everything and there's a map showing you where they are in in correlation of the kit it's all uh and then what does this cost uh, this is a three thousand dollar kit, um, and we'll do it. We'll, we're we're doing it on sale today, but uh, it'll be around how much is it? Around two grand. I thought you the, said it was eighteen hundred. Huh? Yeah, well, it'll, it's eighteen hundred for people that are here today. Okay. Yes, All right. So this was eighteen hundred dollars at the show. The homegrown bunker buster kit. But if you get it online, how much is it? Two grand. Two grand. Not a bad deal. There's Generac. Hybrid light. Where I live, 35. Right, I killed it. Ah, a Jeep with an EMP shield. Just look for the yellow bag. It's so there it is. Is that all you do is eggs? That's all we do is eggs. We know eggs. <laughs> you know eggs. <laughs> I know eggs in the face. Good. I was expecting when Brad did the shots to take off. I was expecting when the shots to take off, he was going to run into the wall. That's Utah search dogs. Yep. So there's an $89 diet and just walk out the air conditioner and that costs $250 so now you're only looking at like a $750 difference. It doesn't make a lot of difference. What did you just do? I just won. <laughs> you're you just won all that food. food. You just won yes. like six thousand dollars of survival so food great. at the Be Prepared Expo, didn't I'm you? So glad I came. <laughs> <laughs> We're so glad you came. That's oh, fantastic. So well, everybody yeah. needs to make sure they're here next year, don't That's they? Absolutely. I'll, I'll put the word out. Good God. Hey, lady, you want to sell it? <laughs> I'm kidding. So here's something I saw at the show. This is the emergency survival chart and he'll be coming out with this in now this one's for salt lake city and uh i guess he'll be coming out with most major cities in the u.s and he'll tell you how to get out of the city what to do when you get out of the city what to look for when you get out of the city it shows the different plants shows how to tie uh knots make fire uh represent uh, rec uh recognize flags letters distress and what to do so this is pretty cool and it's made on a material that won't get wet and this is military grade stuff tyvek tyvek yeah that is cool cool very very cool you can take this one too no uh, I, I got i got what i need 
this one I've been trying to see. These are $150 at the show. They got a little viewing window on them. Those are cool. Yeah, you can see what's going on. Yeah. Got a little smoke stack. Man, that one's got taller legs on it. Style. So all the Woodlander styles have a round body, three leg design. They sit a little taller, and then the Nomad style is a square body. Yeah. Legs fold up underneath. The, which one would you have in the tent? So, so these these are really small. These these are all. So, yeah. Uh, two main sizes, medium and large, yeah. but same kind of two styles, the Woodlander style with the round body. And, the and that one's 150 as well? Well, this is just show special stuff. So the tent stoves, they're going to range at retail anywhere from 300 to 400. And how much is that one right there? This one right here, this one's going to retail at 450. And what's the show special? Uh, show special right now, I think we're doing those at 200. Wow. Well, we got a card here, we've got a code. If anybody and that includes that whole ventilation. Yeah, so not, not the triple wall or the flashing, but it does include all these pipe sections, the full stack. Well, what does this thing do? Yeah, so this is a flashing kit and triple wall pipe. So if you're oh, going to install your this, right, so you'd install this in your tent, you'd run the triple wall out of the flashing kit, and that's going to disperse all your heat so you're not in contact with any of your tent fabric. Wow, what else you got here? So just different styles. So, so this is like a Nomad view. It has the side glass in it. This is the uh, regular Nomad. It's got a little large. window so yeah, you can see your food cooking. Um, and this is actually a really slick design on the glass. If you ever break the glass, there's yeah. just some thumb screws here. That piece will just slide out and you can slide a new piece in if you ever have a problem. So the glass. fire doesn't cause the glass to break? It does not. That's like Pyrex. It's like really high temperature glass. Um, sometimes people in their truck rattling around on a bumpy that one's, break That was 200, but it's bigger than the one over there. Yeah, that one's pretty small. Yeah, so this is this is a stove. This is called the Large Woodlander. This is the one I'd recommend to, to folks. It's just no glass in the sides. This one has glass in both sides. Um, but this is just a great stove. This is the one I use normally. Um, and this one here with all so, the setup? So these are just accessories. Yeah. So the stove comes like this with like the full stack of pipe. But you can get a pipe oven accessory. This is a folding oven accessory. We do the water jacket accessories. And then we do all the elbows too. So you can get 45s, 90s, you know, if you want to exit the pipe out of a wall. So this is our fast fold titanium stove. So this is super packable. All this folds flat, weighs less than five pounds. Uh, so this is kind of your backcountry horse packing, backcountry hunting stove. You put in like a lightweight teepee, but just super packable and easy to put together with these tabs. Uh, there's no really parts or screws to lose. Um, what does that sell for? So out? that retails 500. Uh, I think we sold the one we brought here today for 250. But, really? Wow! Yeah. So you really got a good show special going yeah, on. Yeah, we got a good show special going. So got a coffee pot. Coffee pot. And then these little photo bowls. Yeah, these are just like little bushcraft stoves. So, so this is like an accessory feeder tray where you can kind of put longer sticks in here and push them into the stove. Um, you know, put a little pot on there. So just a lightweight backpacking stove. You don't want to deal with gas or anything like that. And what uh, those sell for? That's a great question. I think these are, for the base stove, I think you're less than a hundred bucks. And then, uh, and so people right will run it. Yeah, that's it right there. So, I mean, that's, you know, that shows you kind of how, they do this in titanium and stainless steel, a little different price on both. Uh, the guys will run it just like that on the ground feed sticks into it you can put a pot on there and then if you want to do the little stand and tray um, wow cool this is great in your backyard or in camp but everything folds make, flat you know, so 45 degree, uh, degree pipe sections or there's a ton of airflow in here so you're going to get a super clean burn yeah uh, it's not like building a smoky fire on the ground but all this folds totally flat uh, slips in a bag that folds flat too so it goes in the back of your truck or somewhere really easy doesn't take up any space but I think and, the and what are these sell for so so I think we're at like 80 100 200 for just the base and then it's you know these are all accessories grates uh, charcoal grate uh, if you want to cook on them. wow and this is all at Winterwell. Winterwell.us. So, and the, the real thing to know about these stoves and fire pits, everything is 304 stainless steel, so uh, nothing's going to rust or corrode. It does really well with the heat. Um, that's food grade stainless steel. So that's kind of
Well, guys, this was one of the interesting booths at the uh, Be Prepared So in Sandy, Utah. This is the thing I just saw. It's from Harvest Right, and it's uh, $26.95. And I guess you put your food in there, you turn it on, and it freeze dries it. Does fish and meat. Everybody's changing in their dollars for gold backs right now. So, sir, how much are you getting? Well, we got sixteen hundred here. Sixteen hundred. You're going to trade in for your gold backs. Yep. Four hundred per envelope. Now, these are really nice too. Very smooth. So this will be kind of like your wallet. Very nice. You felt that? So serve. Yep. I sure do love me those gold backs. So hey guys, just a little moment to remind all you guys who came out and saw me at the Be Prepared Expo in Sandy, Utah. I made this little closing bit for today's video. But hey, listen, make sure you like and subscribe. If you want to help support my channel, I have a drop page. It's this right here, shelterwithatlas.com. But make sure you come out and see me at the 2023 Be Prepared Expo in Sandy, Utah.